Okay, so this is a four minute challenge, trying to work all body parts. You're gonna work your legs, upper body, and your abs. Okay, so you're gonna ask for four minutes, you're gonna try and do as many reps or as many sets as you can through each one. So you're gonna do squats, then press-ups, then sit-ups continuously. Squats, press-ups, then sit-ups with perfect technique. So I'll show you the exercises first. First one is basically squat. So feet shoulder width apart, feet facing forward. Try and keep the fingertips on a temple, sit all the way down, stand all the way up. Stay keeping your heads up, back straight. Drive the heels into the floor when you stand up. Press ups, hands just over shoulder width apart. Drive the hands into the floor as you push up, body nice and straight. Okay, and when we're doing a sit up, stick the heels into the floor, fingertips on the temples, elbows coming to the thighs at the top. Really important you lift or you curl up from the floor, don't lift from your lower back when we're doing sit ups. So as you see with the BMF, you've got blue, reds and greens. So you're gonna do an easy option is the four reps of each. Intermediate is five, and then the advanced version is six reps of each. And these guys are going to show you how it's done. So blues, fours, reds, five, green, six. Squats first, then press-ups, then sit-ups. Four minutes. Stand by. Go. Okay, so remember, perfect technique. Don't sacrifice your technique for speed. You're trying to last as long as you can through the four minutes. Make sure you straighten your arms at the top. Don't lock out the elbows, though. Okay, so dig the heels into the floor when we're doing these sit-ups. Don't let the heels come off the floor. We're trying to work your abs, not your hip flexors. Drive the heels into the floor. Feet in a little bit, pointing forwards. That's it. Heads up, back straights when we're doing squats. So it's really important when you do the squats, you drive your heels into the floor. That way it engages your backside and hamstrings much more. This obviously starts off nice and easy. As it starts to get harder, always concentrate on good technique. That's good, dig the heels in, curl the spine off the floor, don't lift from your lower back. So remember doing the full sit-ups, fingertips on the temples, elbows into the thighs. That's one minute gone. That's good, good press-ups there, perfect technique, well done. Perfect on the sit-ups. Okay, if you struggle with full sit-ups, you can obviously go for the easier option of half sits. But on these sit-ups, don't come up too high. Your fingertips on the temples, elbows to the knees for a reason. Don't come up too high on the full sit-ups. Good press-ups there, red 86, excellent technique. And again, if we need to, you can go onto your knees to do the press-ups if you're a beginner. So still remember, you're always doing four, five, or six reps. Don't come up too high. Elbows into the thighs. That's better. Good. Much better. That's good. Perfect technique on a squat. Excellent. Excellent press-ups. Green 35. Perfect technique. So again, little tips when you're doing exercises, when you're doing press-ups, trying to drive your hands into the floor. Try and push the floor away from you rather than trying to push yourself up. That way it engages your chest muscles much more. Second beep, you have less than two minutes left, guys. Less than two minutes to go. It should be getting cheeky about now. <laughs> if not already very cheeky. So remember, as you're starting to get tired, always concentrate on technique. You're trying to get as far as you can through this four minute set. That's good. Remember all those little points on a sit-up, dig the heels into the floor. Keep those feet, feet down, feet down. That's good technique, 86. Well done, well done. Drive the heels into the floor in the squat. Drive the hands into the floor in the press-ups. Dig the heels into the floor on the sit-ups. Done really well, guys. Final minute coming up. Final minute. Good, just control your drop on the squats, control the drop on the squats. Still great technique on the press-ups there, 37, perfectly straight body, that's brilliant. 45 seconds left, guys, let's go. Dig deep, squeeze out the last few reps. All under control, all good technique, right to the end. Good, 30 seconds. Here we go, this is where it counts, guys. Try and squeeze in at least two more sets if you can. Again, still smashing out those press-ups over there, 35. That's excellent, mate. Good technique. 
Dig those heels into the floor on a sit up. Good, last 10. Last five. And rest, excellent work guys. Just slowly stand up, stand up nice and tall.